our morning Bible blast. This is Matthias 76, and we are Decoding the Deception. First Peter 5, 8, be self-controlled and alert. Your enemy, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, seeking someone to devour. This verse is a continuation of a thought process that Peter was sharing with us, an overall admonition. So we need to go back and remind ourselves, first, we are to humble ourselves, humble yourselves, therefore under God's mighty hand, that he may lift you up in due time. We humble ourselves by remembering we don't want to be that lamb that thinks it's okay on its own and will wander away from the protection of the shepherd. Peter pictures that as being under the hand, the mighty hand of God. Also, we are to cast all your anxiety on him because he cares for you. As fishermen throw their nets, we throw our problems over to Jesus, trusting that he is going to take care of them. Those things that would weigh us down on our journey as we follow our shepherd, we're to cast on him and let him take care of him, trusting that he will do what's best for us. Now back to our verse, be self-controlled and alert. Your enemy, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, looking for someone to devour. Now, I don't know about you, but I've been to many zoos many times, and for us here in this civilized world, when we think of a lion, we probably think of something like this. And actually, for most of my visits to zoos, I would have been thrilled to see this much of the lion. I usually got to see a couple feet and a tail swooshing back and forth from behind a bush. Not all that intimidating, not all that frightening. But that is not the lion that Peter warns us of. No, it's this guy. He is fierce. He is always on the prowl. He doesn't sleep. It is Satan. He doesn't sleep. He doesn't take vacations. And he's been on the job for 10,000 years, and he is very good at what he does. He wants to separate us from the herd, separate us from the flock. He wants us to be weighed down with cares and concerns and troubles so that we lag behind and stray away from our shepherd so that he can prey upon us. The remedy is to be like the meerkat here in this picture, always vigilant. Be self-controlled and alert. Your enemy, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion looking for someone to devour. Be self-controlled. The other way this can be translated is sober. Be in your right mind. And we, we maintain that state spiritually of being in the right mind when we're humble, when we're casting our troubles on Jesus. Be alert. We need to work out our own salvation with fear and trembling. It's easy to trip up and stumble and fall. So humble yourselves, therefore, under God's mighty hand, that he may exalt you in due time. And we do that as we cast all our care on him because he cares for you. And we need to do that because our adversary is so fierce, he is so dangerous, and he seeks our destruction, our eternal destruction. And so today, just for today, and always, but especially today, be self-controlled and alert. Your enemy, your enemy, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, looking for someone to devour. But your good shepherd has something else in mind. Blessings and mercy and peace. Follow him. That concludes our morning Bible blast. We encourage you to go to our website and there on the homepage, down in the lower left, 
we have a place that you can give us your email address. We don't want to let the social media technocrats keep us apart. Remember, YouTube can shut us down at any time. We have a backup plan. We promise we won't use your email address for any other purpose. We need your support. You can do that on our website at the support page. It's very simple also down below. There's a link to Patreon and our PayPal page. You can support us there. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up down below. And if you like it, please consider sharing. We would love to have you subscribe. And if you subscribe, please remember to click that bell so you get notified when we put out new content. Finally, down below, leave your comments. We love to hear from you. That feedback means a great deal to us. This is Matthias 76. We are decoding the deception. God bless and have a great day.